Samantha McCormick has had the idea of opening her own dance fitness studio for years. Her success in the Gordon Ford College of Business has helped put her goal within reach. Here we go. Samantha McCormick's dream is about to come true. This is the space. Next month, Taboo Dance and Fitness will open on Russellville Road. I've been screaming from the rooftops about what I'm going to do, and here it is. The WKU business major who graduated last December has won a string of competitions that allowed her to tweak her business model and win some cash along the way. Everything I've went to state for, everything I've been trying to prove to people, all the people that told me I couldn't do it, you know, like this is a defining moment in my life. McCormick spent much of this last semester polishing her presentation, which helped her gain even more momentum toward her business plan. And when I went to Regents, oh, it was hard going against, you know, we're talking about MBA students. Hey, I'm little old me <laughs> from Bowling Green. But I knew I had a big idea and I had a big personality. That big idea is to open a studio for non-traditional workouts. I wouldn't say I'm a healthy health buff or like to work out a lot, but I think I would work out if I had those types of classes here. So why not be the one that comes up with the idea first? Now the single mom is focused on the next step of opening a business she's been dreaming about for the last four years. Things can happen when you put hard work to it, you know, and you might have all of these obstacles, but it is possible. You know, I am living, breathing proof of that. Taboo Dance and Fitness will open at 2341 Russellville Road, Suite 103, sometime in mid-June. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.